Okay, here we're going to tie a surf candy fly or an epoxy fly, you may call it. Good fly for Spanish mackerel, albacore, bonita. Very durable fly as well. Go ahead and wrap in some white slinky fiber. This is on a Mustad 3407. Uh, number two hook come through here with some olive green slinky fiber you can use whatever color you like for this particular fly I'm gonna put some olive green in I do use a lot of blues chartreuse even some red at times so attach that in Come in with some holographic mylar flash. I like to put a pretty decent amount of this onto the fly. Let's go ahead and tie this in right on the top. Take a second to make sure everything is even. Go ahead and tie it in, make a nice little body. Whip finish it off. Now I'm using some Spirit River woven body tubing. This is the medium and the natural pearl color. I'm going to take this, cut it about an inch or so onto this particular hook, slide it on. Come through, reattach your thread. I'll take a little patience here and get this uh, tubing wrapped on. Sometimes it'll want to keep slipping off of the tubing. Get your little head built up here. Put some pressure on this thread. You can grab that tubing really good. Alright, we've got it good there. We'll go ahead and whip finish this off. There we go. That fly is almost done. We'll just trim it up a little bit. I like to leave mine a little long. I can always make it shorter in the field. And uh, now we're going to epoxy this fly. I'll mix, some, mix up some epoxy. We'll be right back and uh, have this fly all done for you. Okay, we've got some five minute epoxy mixed up now. Let's go ahead and apply this on here. Give it a good coating. Trying to get too much into your your tail there, but you want to finish it off back there nicely by getting a little bit into the tail, not too much. All right, get it up around your thread wrap there. a little more all right you take this off and stick it in your turner and you're all done ready for some Spanish mackerel